we are going to make a remote control cannon for that I am using a circuit from this car I need this receiver circuit and I will remove the everything else So here we have this receiver circuit and we are going to operate this with this remote. And I am going to use a vaporizer from this wave as an igniter of the cannon. Here this part contains the circuit and the power cell. and there is an automizer or the vaporizer in this module here you can see the threads are wrapped in a metallic coil let us remove this rubber first of all and now i will remove the excess parts Here this coil wrapped on the threads are actually a vaporizer and I am going to use the, as the ignition of the cannon and now we are going to connect the, all the parts together. I will solder this gearbox mechanism with the receiver circuit to drag the cannon and this beautiful wheels it gives the shape of the cannon now uh, okay let's see if it is working or not okay it's working and now we need a platform to connect all the circuits and the battery together so here I have this plastic strip and I will glue them together And now I will place the bake wheel. And the only thing remaining is to put the cannon on it and it's ready to work. Here this one is the antenna. I will just stick it somewhere and here I am using this transparent pipe and it needed to be blocked from one side which I have already done and now I will stick it on its place
let's remove the wheel here I am going to put a switch and a trigger so that when we take a reverse the switch gets on and it fires the cannon it's quite simple mechanism and there are uh, lots of other mechanism which can be used but it's easy for me to arrange well I already placed the trigger and I'm going to put a switch and on the switch I am going to put this plastic piece so that it gets a large area to to be triggered I'm using an instant glue so uh, we don't have to wait for it to dry I already marked the place where I have to place the switch it needs to be accurate to with the play place we are um, putting the switch okay here I already fixed the wheel and I am going to make a hole where we are going to put a fuse to light the cannon. Okay, it was quite easy. And here I am using this capacitor of 3.7 Faraday to ignite the cannon. Well here you can see the spark, it's really powerful. As an igniter I am using this wire I have removed from the vape. And now I have to do a wiring work. Here you can see the circuit diagram. It's quite easy, I have just uh, connected them in series. After doing all this wiring work, it's ready to work. Well it's quite quite joyful to play with the remote control cannon I will use the solid balls to fire from the cannon but before that we will have to fill it with gunpowder here I am having this explosive from the firecrackers well we, we will use just a little bit and now I will put a tissue paper inside to create a pressure and now we will put a ball inside and it's ready to launch just take a reverse and it will be launched Hope you enjoyed this video and sure to subscribe. See you in the next video.